hi guys and girls welcome back to my channel i do hope you're doing well as you can see by the thumbnail i got a little carried away at the range oopsie uh, <laughs> i don't just have this bag i also do have another huge bag which has another familiar face but guys i love the range at christmas i absolutely adore it let me tell you it's probably one of my favorite christmas shops at this time of year and i'm just like i'm here for it there was also some bargains because some of these bits i picked up online not just in store if you don't have a range near you you sometimes can't get little bits of baubles and stuff like that but the big bits have a look because they had some cracking bargains and i was like you know what i'm snapping you right up so please get comfy get your soft drink alcoholic drink hot drink cold drink get some snacks because we've got two huge bags from the range here and I am so excited to show you because we do have another addition to the Gonk family. <laughs> right. I think it's only right that we start with one of the main guys. Because as I say, there is more than one. Guys, we have another Gonk. I have gone for this gorgeous emerald green velvet Gonk. Look at him. Look, look, look. He's not extendable, but he is a wobbly one. You know, like the... Uh, red sequin one that we got from Matalan a couple of years back now oh goodness gracious i almost broke him already he has a lovely tall hat let's have a look can you see his hat in full entirety i need you i need you to see him in his full entirety okay these come in all colors pink gray blue gold red everything i went with green because i thought you know what i didn't get a green gonk last year when i had my green hair so i thought you know what it's delayed you may be able to go with a clue of the colour for something else that I got later on. Perhaps uh, relating to this year's hair colour. These are normally £25. Which I still think is good value for a gonk this size. Online, I don't know if I still like it, but I'll leave the range Christmas bit below. If they are still online, they're down to £15 right now, okay? Stop this video. Obviously come back to it. Pause it and go on the range to see if these are still 15 Because... You need these in your life. I was very... I was torn because it was either this, a baby pink, or a grey one. And then I realised I couldn't have all three. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to get two options of things, but the gonk is going to be green. Mummy G absolutely freaked when she saw him. She was like, yes, Shan. When I told her that he was £15, she was gobsmacked. I feel like I'm going to have to put you here. Let's just rest your back, Mr. Gonk, all right? Because they did have a few other bits that were in the sale, and so I'm sure you will see a, another figurine. However, online and in-store, in-store is better for your baubles and everything. However, there was a few that I was able to get online. And then in-store, baubles, your tinsel, online, your bigger accessories, okay? So, we all know me and mum love elf boots this is a little elf bow now this was 199 okay i don't actually know if it's a bow to go on a present or a bow that we can hang up somewhere i'm hoping it's a bow we can hook somewhere because that was my vibe for it but how cute because you know me and mum we love all themes the only color we don't really have on the tree is purple but we are very much like grinch candy cane vibe i feel like i'm gonna sneeze i feel like i'm coming down guys we've got back from iceland i was absolutely fine there i've woke up this morning i've had the worst throw and i feel like i'm getting the sniffles and the sneezes but apparently there's like a big cold that's taking over the uk at the moment and wiping people out for three weeks so fingers crossed i haven't got that maybe i'm just a little bit under the weather i think it's travel blues holiday blues i'm gonna go with that but uh yes i'm a little bit congested at the moment so apologies if my voice is a little deeper than normal but we we go with the show okay we go with the show now i did manage to get a few baubles online and again there's no particular theme at all with these you know me and mama g we literally just pick up what we like so the baubles for the range they vary between normally one pound 29 and they can go up to about i think the most expensive one i got was 3.99 compare that to garden centers your cheapest is normally about 3 dollars so I don't actually think the range is that bad. The first one I picked up, this was $1.79 if I remember correctly, is a candy cane rope bauble. So can you see it's like all woven? Yes, we love that and very, very nice. 
And this one, just a very simple one. This, I think, was the 129 one. Oh, it has it on there. How great is that? I didn't even realise that. So this one, guys, was 179 as I thought. And this one was 159 And this is just a simple red glass ball ball. And it says, Merry Christmas. And I love a bit of red. I actually love all the colours at Christmas. I can't lie. I can't lie, guys. Now, this little guy... He was $4.99 and I love this. He is going straight in the kitchen because I feel like he's got jelly beans on him or like M&Ms. You see what I mean? It's just a little gonk and it has joy with a candy cane. But I feel these are like M&Ms. M&Ms or jelly tots, something like that. So I thought, you know what? You are cute. You are going in the kitchen. I can't wait to decorate. I know we are very late on decorating, guys. But it is coming very soon. I'm going to try. This weekend we're in London. So I'm going to try and manoeuvre it around. And fingers crossed. We will get it done. I do apologise. I feel like I'm swallowing a lot. <laughs> You're probably like, Shan, shut up. I do feel like I'm swallowing a lot at the moment. But it's just that little niggle. You know, like when you feel the bit of like tonsillitis. Finger update. You wouldn't know about this because you haven't seen the vlog yet. But... I ripped my nail clean off in Iceland. Yeah. Below the nail bed, bleeding. It's very traumatic. Just wait till you see the Iceland vlog because I did actually go into hysterics about it. But uh, you know me. You know me. Now, this. I was very surprised with this. So this was down in the bathroom section. And I feel like it was 2 99 Let me just take off the protective popper on it. Because you know me and mum. We have multiple hand wash dispensers, don't we? We have Gingerbread Man, we have the Santa, we've got the Christmas tree. But I saw this and I was like, it's always handy for the kitchen. That is exactly what I need to clean my nose. This is the Peppermint Swirl Refillable Hand Soap. And it's just Santa's face. And as I say, this was roughly $2.99. I love this Peppermint Swirl. It is pure mint and i could just sit here inhaling that all day it's you know like the nice therapeutic scent like a vix or a eucalyptus love it i mean another refillable that we probably don't need but hey ho we've gone with it we've got it and <laughs> right you guys know i love gingerbread so i saw a few gingerbread decorations and I just, I just had to pick them up, guys. And they're very unique in their own way. So we have this little guy. I feel he was one twenty nine. He doesn't have a price on, but how cute is he? Canon, look, how cute is that little guy? And then this one, I feel one ninety nine. He was, but look, he's got the candy cane. This, however, is glitter everywhere. So when you are handling this. Please be careful because currently I'm in black tights on new bedding and I've got this. So um, we're just going to put you on the bag right there because I can't be getting glitter everywhere because Mama G has only just changed the bed, which you will see in Vlogmas. She changed it. You'll probably see a little bit. We've gone for a green number. And one of you lovelies have said to me about a teddy bear setting. Setting? Teddy bear bedding. I tried to look on Asda because a lot of you sent me one a candy cane. I couldn't get that. And then I had a few of you send me over a tartan red gonk check one. Teddy bear from the range. Your girl only managed to get it today. So again, Vlogmas, you may see another change of the bed. We, uh, <laughs> we're going to have to tread carefully with Mama G because I say she's only just changed it, bless her. And if I ask her to change it again, she's probably not going to be happy with me. So um, we'll just see how that goes. Now, this, I love the range for the plaques. And if I remember correctly, this was under a fiver. I wouldn't have paid more for it. They're normally between like $3.50 and $4.99. And it says, family Christmas rules. Smile and be happy. Squeeze the presents. Give Santa milk and cookies. Give more than you get. Listen for reindeer. Hang stockings and mistletoe. Have fun. Sing carols. Welcome friends. Spend time with family. Be merry and bright. Keep the glass full all day. I love that one. Be kind, sing carols, hang stockings, jingle all the way. Now, if you remember, 
me and mum have a plaque like this it's more of a slate plaque and it's uh from elf's best way to spread christmas cheer is singing loud for all to hear that normally goes in the kitchen this i feel i want to go in the hall this i feel what needs to go in the hall because again we're decorating for christmas but i don't quite know how it's going to go because arrangements and where things used to go we might not be able to get everything out but i think with the next few hauls coming, I've got a good start of new bits to put at, and then we will just decorate as and when you go. But I am so, so looking forward to getting that blooming tree up to the point where I said to mum, I feel with the way I feel, I want to get the tree up maybe off camera, let it settle for a couple of days, and then we can get straight into decorating it in our matching PJs. But the matching PJs we've got, guys, we always get the fluffy ones, don't we? And what happens? The furry bits always stick to the pyjamas. So just, just you wait and see, okay? Because it's going to be very, very comical. Now, I love this. And this was £1.59. This in a garden centre, you'd easily pay a fiver for. So it's a lovely glass ball ball. And the snowflake is like holly colours. You see it's like green swirls with the little red dots. And I love that. As I say, we didn't want to go overboard with decorations because if you know anything from our christmas videos we do go a little bit overboard and i think this year we may be losing a tree so we've got to try and see what baubles we want on what we're going to go through again for potentially going to charity shop if they're a little bit old we'll see how it goes but um yes it's very exciting very very exciting guys because i feel i don't want to jinx it but I feel I've got a lot of plans for next year. And next year I do really want to move out. It is just hard trying to find somewhere. And I feel I may have to go for a flat. But I don't want to because I want my garden space. I want the stairs. Like I want a little home. Whether it's terrace, detached, semi-detached. I mean, I can't even afford detached or semi-detached. Not in my area. It's probably hard enough to do a detached, uh, terraced. But... I want to see what's out there and I'm thinking if I get something next year this could potentially be my last Christmas at home so maybe I don't want it filled filled to the point where like we can't maneuver around but just make it nice warm and cozy because I think we've done that for Halloween and autumn we literally just decorated with the bits that we had but I still want that main tree up because that's still mine and mum's tree and who knows if I move out Next year could be me and mum decorating my home because that tree will be coming with me. That's like the big boy. And then we'll have decorates with mum. Oh my God, we would be decorating mum's place in Vlogmas. This room would be back the living room. So who knows? Every cloud has a silver lining, eh? Anyway, another bauble, guys. 159. And you know me, I do love to have things with robins for the people that are no longer with us, our friends and family that have passed. I love a good robin one. Absolutely love it these i freaking love these from the range guys these are 4.99 and now these big wooden plaques do you remember i got one for autumn said hello autumn look at this one snuggle season i absolutely love that you have the hanger on it which is a lovely sage green and there is also i didn't realize a hook on it so you could just hook it up if you didn't want to hang it but yeah those big big favorites of mine now along with this is very glittery, guys. It's going to go absolutely everywhere. $3.99. Look at the size of this ball ball. This gives me like Anastasia Romanoff vibes. If you've seen the Disney Pixar film, you know what I mean. But it opens. $3.99. Look at that. Look at that. I saw it and I was like, Mum, I need that in my life. And she was like, it's fine. Let's get it. So, yes, I love them. I remember I got one from Matalan a few years back. The Christmas pudding. Do you remember that, guys? If you're an OG, you'll remember that one. And, yeah, I've seen this one. And I'm like, oh, you're coming home with me. Now, my darlings, that is one bag done. But don't think that that is uh, where it stops. Because we have the big one next. And can you see? You might not be able to. He's hiding away. There is another familiar face for the channel. <laughs> right let's start with another cushion because you know what we always need another cushion don't we in here guys i mean we actually don't but don't shout at me i saw this and i absolutely fell in love if i remember correctly i picked this up online and it was about 7.99 but it's just a simple white cushion 
with little crocheted Santa's hats on. You see that? And the back is plain white. I mean, minus a red thread, but the back is plain white. So if you didn't want the festivities, but I love this. I absolutely love this. And I'm feeling like you can go there. I mean, I've just knocked my whole cushion display, but we'll work with it. We will work with it. Now, this is adorable. £1.99. You know me and mum, we love mini trays in the house at Christmas time. You know little ones just to put your mulled wine on, to put your mince pie, one or two or a few. This was, I say, one twenty nine. Christmas is coming. Look at that. How cute is that? Absolutely lovely. And it's called the Gonk Christmas is Coming tray. I love it. I feel like I could, like, take mum, if we have a McDonald's breakfast, take her little, like, egg McMuffin and hash brown in that. Should be loving life, bless her. Absolutely loving life. Right. I did get a few big things. <laughs> Oopsie. I need to see what batteries do these take. Two big ones. Okay. So I haven't got batteries in these yet, guys. But I picked up this sign. And it says, Christmas wishes and mistletoe kisses. It's the time to eat, drink and be merry. Now, this was $8.99. Which I think... For a item this large, it is very worthy. It is standalone, so you can have it like that. Or it does also have the two hooks if you want to put it on. But it does have one, two, three. I think there's about four or five little LED lights that will be in there. So I cannot wait to get this out because I feel this could look really nice in the hallway. Like on the centrepiece of the table. I love it. And as I say, when the lights go on... Yes, you know me and mum, we love anything that lights up. We are children. I mean, mum is a child. Let's let's make it honest. When it comes to Christmas, Mummy G is an absolute child and she absolutely loves it. Oh, I've got another cushion. I forgot about that. <coughs> <coughs> oh, God, sorry, guys. <laughs> Literally caught my own breath and took it away. I forgot I had another one. Let's just ignore that for the moment. When I say mum was a child, when she saw this, she was like, Shan, yes. So online, there are some items from the range from a place called Marketplace. And I don't know if they are select brands or companies that you don't get in the shop. Because I've never seen like stuff like this in the shop. But they come directly from the supplier because there's no delivery charge on most of these Marketplace stuff. And it was a two-piece bath mat set. So we managed to get the toilet pedestal because, yes, we are still old-fashioned. We still still do love a good toilet pedestal mat with the matching bath mat. Now, when I tell you mum was a child when she saw this, she was a child. It also has the non-slip back, like the grippy backs. Two set, so your pedestal and your bath mat, £13, which some people may say expensive. I think... That to get a matching set for that, in it's themed, and it's soft, I don't think it's too bad. And as I say, mum was um, very ecstatic when she saw that, like, literally to the point of, <gasps> I was like, okay, mother, we will decorate. She was like, Sean, when are we decorating? I'm like, we're trying, gonna try and get it sorted this weekend, mother, okay? She was very, very happy indeed. Now, I already have my bed made, but it didn't mean that I couldn't not get another throw. But this is an unusual throw for me. So this is the Love Christmas Knitted Throw. 1.27 by 1.52. So it's not as big as the normal throws. The Home Sense ones are like 1.5 by 1.7. But it's knitted. And this was 9 99 I haven't got a knitted throw. And I just thought this is the perfect style to like cuddle up to. Or literally drape over you. Almost like a snuddy. Like a hooded blanket. So I saw this and I thought, you know what? You're very festive. And I actually like you a lot. So, yes, this went straight in the basket. And I was like, you know what? I'm happy with that. I know I do have my bed done now, but that will go great when I get my new bed in. <laughs> so I'm just like, Mum. I said to her, I said, uh, I may have ordered another bedding set. She goes, Shan. I'm like, but like, if you like it, you can have it. So that's how I'm going to play it because I think she will like it. So I might pick one up for Christmas. And then she went, oh, no, I don't want one. I've got my one from last year. I was like, well, would you like a teddy bear version? She was like, no. I'm like, she's so hard to buy for. I say to her, what do you want for Christmas? Nothing. I'm like, 
what do I get you? Because I actually don't know just yet. I have no idea at all. I don't think, I think I've got a couple of things, that's it. I've got Dada sorted, I've got my partner sorted. Mama G, I don't know what to get her this year because she actually says I don't want anything. So I think there'll be a few little red envelopes. And I don't know. I don't know. If anyone has any suggestions, please do let me know because say I ask her and she says, I don't want nothing. I'm like, okay. Okay, okay. Right. Now I've got this online, guys. <laughs> but I feel I might already have this. I don't feel I have this exact one. I feel I've got a bigger version in grey. But I definitely feel like I have one of these houses. If you remember from last year, you'll let me know. This was £9 if I remember. So it is a snowy house LED. But this whole... Oh, my little tree's bent. We have to stick you up a bit more? Because you're a bit on the wonk. I feel I have got this, but in the... I feel like a big, tall, grey version. I'm not entirely sure, because I haven't got stuff out of the Christmas boxes. But when I saw it, I was like, oh, you look familiar. But as I say, this is in a gorgeous baby blue. And I definitely don't feel I have baby blue. I feel it is definitely a grey. But a lot taller. That's the vibe that I'm thinking of. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to see, guys. We'll have to see. But I do definitely feel like I've had that. And again, it's LED. So we're going through mainly the light-up stuff. Because a lot of our light-up stuff, we keep for year in, year out. But we actually don't get rid of any of them. Because they're just like sentimental pieces that we hold. So mum said, right, this year, we need to clear out the LED bits. Or the stuff that don't light up. And we'll like donate them to charity. They might be able to get a couple of quid like using them as a standing object. Or we'll look into replacing them. So I'm like, okay. They're just like a few... A little bit, you know. I did get another cushion. <laughs> but this is cute. I mean, all of the stuff's cute. But this is like extra cute. I feel again, it was around about 9 99 Maybe 7 99 to 9 99 First off, one side is this lovely cream teddy bear. Which I can't get too near because my hair is still in the bleeding stage. So I don't want to dye you blue. So if this is your vibe, more of just like a neutral, neutral, creamy, furry cushion for the winter months. Or if not, a very subtle winter scene. So you have on here a little rabbit. And I think there's a fox and a reindeer. Yeah. But it's just a very simple, understated Christmas cushion, I think. And it's actually not a bad wadding, you know. It's not too bad. So again, I'm going to redo all of my uh, cushion setup because I feel like now I have two new cushions to put in there. So I need to rejig you. Will I have you all there or will I have you built up in a corner? Oh, I don't know. I don't know, my lovelies. And then, right, are you ready? Are you ready for this? I don't think you are. I don't think you're ready for this jelly. I don't think you're ready. This, again, was online. And he was £25 down to 15 Again, like the gonk, we have many numerous colours. Grey, pink. The pink I was eyeing up. The pink was gorgeous, but I thought, no. We'll try and change it up. They had green, they had silver, they had gold, red, everything. But this colour just stood out to me. And I thought, you know what? I will forever remember the year that I got him. And my love is that is another Santa Claus. And look at what colour he is. He is blue velvet. Even for 25 quid, me and mum was going to pick him up. When I saw him down to 15 with his little blue velvet hat with snowflakes, his little silver pouch on. Look at that. His older jazzy silver torso. He's holding his snowflake. Let's put his little cloak around a little bit more. Look at his cape. Absolutely magnificent, isn't your Santa? It's so soft as well. So, so soft. I thought for 15 quid, you need to go in my basket. There's no doubt about it. And I wish I could have bought more of you. I really do. I feel like I'm going to sneeze. 
I did. Bless me, that's been coming this whole video. Um, I absolutely love him. I adore him. I absolutely adore him. I wish I could have bought all your colours. But I feel this is a style that's never going to go out of fashion. The range will have these year in, year out, like the gong. So I think, you know what? I will just add to you every year. And then before you know it, I'm going to have to have a storage unit just for the gongs and centres. Hint update on the lockup. It's getting very full. It's got the stuff for when I move out and it's got all the autumn and Halloween bits. And there's still a little bit of space. And I'm like, all the Christmas bits need to fit in there. And then that's it. That's like done dusted. But it's a um, 100 square foot unit. It's, it's quite big. It's very, very big. It's probably like... Is it maybe the size of my room? I've got like two big double doors on it. No, maybe a tad smaller. I'm not too sure. But it's big, okay? And I'm just like... <laughs> Obviously, I don't know if you're going to be able to have much more in there so uh we might have to look at not another storage unit i might have to have another declutter of the shed because the sheds the shed's just full of boxes to be honest guys <laughs> it's just full of boxes at the minute so we need to sort that out. but this guy 15 quid 15 pound and i could not be happier i absolutely adore him absolutely love him and he is the newest addition to the family alongside the gong and Mama G is very happy with all of this. She is extremely ecstatic that we've got all these new additions. We've got all these new gonks and Santas. And that Christmas is finally getting underway in our household. But guys, I need to lay him down. Oh no, you can go next to Mr. Gonk. My bed is filled with festivities. We've got cushions, we've got throws, we've got baubles, we've got Santa and a gonk. That means that, of course, the Christmas range hall is done. <laughs> so, my lovelies... That is the end of our Christmas range haul. They seem to be getting better and better every year. They really, really do. And I'm like, I have no words. I have no words, guys. I just want it all. I want it all. I want a home permanently decorated for Christmas, which I think mum's worried because when I get my own place, she said, I think you might actually just keep the decorations up all year round. <laughs> or I'll just have one room that's like my Christmas room. And I'm like, no. No, we're not taking them down. We're just going to have my reading room could be my Christmas room. Who am I? I'm not having a reading room. Maybe a box room or a little thing under a stairs if I was able to get a home. But who knows, guys, eh? Who knows what is in the limelight for next year? All I know, 2024, I'm actually, like, looking forward to you. I am a bit apprehensive because it's the last year in my 20s. Not going to lie. Having a slight meltdown. But we're going to try and grasp it with both hands, Okay. But guys, I don't want to sit here and root rabbit and ramble on all day and take up any more of your time. If you did enjoy the video, you know what to do. Hit that thumbs up and subscribe down below. Leave us a comment. What was your favourite bit from the haul? Have you seen these? Are they the same price in store perhaps? Or is it just online? They're a little bit cheaper. And have you got any of this yourself? I love it when you guys say, I had that or I've got that. I'm like, we're twinning. This is why we're on the same wavelength. We are twinning. But Jess, guys, take care. Stay safe as always. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Thank you.